Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk. What it says, United States versus Ricky Ross. And after I saw what they was doing, Hussam Hussein, I said, man, they will use all that to bring you to justice. Mm -hmm. To their justice, so. You keep saying your name, and I keep thinking about Rick Ross and how he... How that all that happened and you was real strong on that when you first came home because i'm telling you i was really in tune with with you I, I i was in you know places you was at and i know you was fighting for that whatever became of that uh they said i should have filed two no no five days before i got out of prison i think that's what the judge said she 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 let them win on statute of limitations but you know it was it's, it's tough on the judge you know you you got a white judge and i'm suing white companies Wow. Good white companies, you know, yeah, who yeah. ain't did no crime in a long time. time yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so how, nobody don't know what crimes they committed. How did that affect you? When when did you did you just I, I'm on to the next thing? I was hurt the day that she she did it, you know, because uh, I was totally thought that 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 we were gonna win. Yeah. You know, I was I was totally under the pressure. No way we're gonna lose this one. Uh, so I was a little little hurt, little disappointed. Uh, um, I probably was more disappointed though when they gave the documentary away. Mm, when wow. they told me that 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 um that, that he believed that the guy when the guy told him that I voided the contract, he believed that that I really did avoid the void the contract. And, I, and he uh, didn't have no proof. Well, he had the guy who 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 Mark Levin who who directed the documentary, they had his proof. He was mm. proof, you know, and he's a good white guy. Yeah. You know, mm. he, he ain't never been to jail before. His word against yours. And then it was an African guy named Mike Mungry who I brought onto the piece. You know, I wasn't going to let Mark do it. Mark didn't want Mike at first. I was like, no, if Mike ain't doing it. You ain't going to do it. I'll get somebody else to do my documentary. Mike wow. is my man. Mike been writing me and taking my calls. He working on this documentary. Mm -hmm. So when he came in, Mark liked the way he worked. Mm. So then when they did the Obama theory, he let Mike shoot the Obama theory and paid him. And that's what he bought Mike with. Mike, for what, mm -hmm. what he did that. Mm -hmm. So now Mike is like, oh, Mark paying me. Rick ain't paying me nothing. Mm -hmm. So, uh, but he didn't have enough sense to say, man, if it wasn't been for Rick, I wouldn't have even been on his piece and I wouldn't have got the Obama theory. You know, because really in techni technically, the way I do business, if I would have got the Obama theory, I would have kicked him a little something you know here man right, here right. five dollars here ten dollars so you go get you one of the more vegan burgers <laughs> <laughs> yeah speaking of that do you do you are you a vegan i'm vegan i say i had to bring that up because 31 is, years wow. wow so you did it before it was popular absolutely that that's Why did that's the difference change uh i'm a lot of reasons i don't want to see people i mean i don't want to see stuff die oh okay. wow okay. yeah yeah i didn't want to see stuff die. i didn't want to be a part of of this the slaughterous mentality that um, that America is is putting down. You know, we fishing all the fish out to sea. You know, we got cows that are polluting the ozone, and you know. It's, but you feel a lot healthier. I don't know. I'm Thirty, 30 years. years. I know. <laughs> I know. But how? But how easy? How easy was it for you to become a vegan back thirty something years ago? Nowadays, they make it so much easier. With you in know, the beginning, it was tough. You know, just. You you just breaking that 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 philosophy that you need me to live. See, I believe I needed me to live. Really? Yeah. See, I um, don't believe that, but it's still hard to to, to stop. <laughs> yeah. Because I know you have beans. You have other things that you can get your protein from. Oh yeah. From. Not now. It's so many things that they 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 substitute with meat. But back then it was tough, especially in jail. You know, my my diet was mostly. Uh, yeah, I was about to say, how can oatmeal, you do that? Oatmeal, peanut butter, uh, beans and rice. That was it. Wow. Yeah. And salads. And, and you never got tired of it. Well, you know, when we eat, see, I read another book too. <laughs> <laughs> the book said, do you live to eat? Or do you, or do you eat, eat to live? live? Or yeah. do you eat to live? Yeah, yeah. And I, I had to, I had to question book. myself and I was like, wow, I've been living to eat. Mm -hmm. But now I want to eat, eat to, to live, live, which I thought was more important. I think it helps your health too. <laughs> I thought about that before because when you really think about, I can't remember how much do you need. Like, you can actually go for days without eating. And even when you see people in Africa who are starving, but they only eat like this little bit for, per day yeah. and they're okay. But then for us who have every all this food readily available and we can't go 
some, some hours without eating because we're starving. And we use that word lightly to say that we're starving, but we're really not. We're the fattest people in the country. <laughs> I mean, the world. In the Americans world, right? are the fattest people in the world. We obese. You know, you right. That's why this virus is, is really kicking our ass because we're so unhealthy. You right. know, we do unhealthy things. We think unhealthy. We eat unhealthy. Uh, we act unhealthy. And, and um, it, it allows stuff like this virus to get in. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.